initiated behind the Smart India Hackathon? So, Smart India Hackathon actually started in 2017 uh, in collaboration with MHRD and uh, MHRD Innovation Cell and AICT. The idea was uh, to encourage the freshly graduate technical students to come up with their own idea which is innovative both in software and hardware field to, um, to answer some questions that will be given by different organizations. So, in first year 2017, we had only the software version of it. So, uh, different ministries, uh, they have uh, given some problem statement in 2017 that the students answered these questions, giving their ideas. In 2018, uh, both the central ministries, departments and state government participated in it and they give, give their problem statements. And that time, we did a small hardware hackathon, which was a pilot run kind of thing. In 2019, we had uh, involved all the ministries as well as companies, the industries, both in software and hardware. And a software version in 2019 has been done in uh, March, March 2019. And hardware version is going on right now. So, different organizations have submitted their problem statements, students are coming up the, with their ideas. And uh, from those ideas, they are expected to make some products. Whoever is the, whatever product is liked by the problem creator organization will be the winning team or taken forward. So, once the uh, SIH is over, both in software and hardware, we usually uh, evaluate one more round of those ideas, winning ideas. And whatever ideas look like has a business viability, we align them with different TBIs, we have done it for the last year hardware hackathon and this year software hackathon also. We have aligned them with the DST approved and DST funded TBIs and they incubate over there and they further develop their products. And sometimes, so basically to encourage them to make their own startup and come up with the product. So that is the basic idea. So, what was the theme for the hardware edition this year? So, there are around 13 to 14 themes. Uh, just to name a few, uh, it is all relevant to the current problems that our country is facing like waste management, clean water, sustainable energy, sustainable environment, smart cities, smart vehicles, smart communication, uh, then um, healthcare and uh, diagnostics, so agriculture. So, these are the few's, a few of the ideas, but mostly all the themes are relevant to the uh, problems that our society is facing nowadays. Yeah, I think they have a KIT has a great facility and there are uh, from the hardware hackathon, there are eight teams I think uh, who are working on the problem statement for Indian oil and there are three teams which are working on uh, Ministry of Textiles problem statement and I have seen some of their product are under making and hopefully they will be finishing with a good product in coming few days and I, uh, there is a great facility by KIT and all the people who I met today. Uh, they are very proactive helping people 24 7 they are helping with them with the high end instruments and all. So, I wished all the best to the students and I am very happy with the way KIT is uh, helping all the teams. Thank you so much yeah. Thank Is you. there anything that you would like to convey to the audience that would be watching your interview? That what I just wish to uh, wish the good luck to all the teams in all the 18 centers that people are working this time. And what I said again to the teams over here that somebody will be the final winner, somebody might not be, but it is a great thing that they have come long way up to, up to this level. Uh, so, uh, as I said more than 1.2 lakh students participated in the harder hackathon only this year and the chosen ones who are right now competing in 18 centers are more around 2000, so 250 teams approximately. So, it is a great way that they have come up to this level. And even if some, if somebody is winner, that is the best, if somebody is not, even their ideas are very good and you never know, it is not always restricted to the winners only. So, any idea that has a good uh, prospect to go forward and that can serve the society, they can uh, be funded by us or by other companies or ministries to go forward and come up with their product to make their startup. So, after shortlisting the, uh, after doing one more round of evaluation after the hackathon is over, Whichever ideas, be it a winning team or not, if has a good uh, business viability to move forward a good potential. So, we will map them with the TBIs, different TBIs 
and they can incubate over there, they can come up with their product, make their own startup in coming few uh, months and uh, sometimes the companies offer them internship, employment, uh, ministries hire them to develop their product and fund them. If not, then we fund from our end and we can take the product for So, good luck to all the students and we expect in 2020 when we have our next SIH, we will have more participation and we will come up with more, uh, more strategies how to do how to make it better in future thank yes. you so much thank you thank you thank you thank you so much